Hey everybody, welcome to my channel. So today I'm getting a facial and I'm really excited about it. I haven't gotten a facial in about eight or nine years, so it's kind of like I'm starting fresh. I've been having a couple trouble areas on my face, so I have bumps. Like I've been having breakouts like on my forehead. I'm not sure where this is coming from. Also on the side of my face. I've been getting bumps all on the side of my face. And I've been having like dry areas around my nose. It's like you're really flaky. Also, I've been having like white heads down here. So I just really want to get this addressed. I'm trying to get into the habit of getting good a good skincare routine. So I didn't want to implement facials. So today is the day that I'm gonna get my facials. So I'm really excited. So join along with me. So this is the esthetician that came to my house. This is Body by Helen. Hey everyone, Body by Helen right here. Yes, black owned. Yes, <laughs> bodybyhelen.com. Yes. So how do you um choose what's the best products for your customers? So I try to go for more, I try to go for more universal products. Um, products that tend to work for all skin types, especially um, African American skin types because our skin type is a lot different from other people's. So I try to go more so along the more sensitive route and especially um, when choosing out my product, um, I try to get a good variety of products so that way from dealing with someone who has dry skin or oily skin, I can figure out which product to use in the midst of the moment. Okay. Sounds great. And you know, I'm glad that you said that mm -hmm. because um, when I got my first facial yeah. I did go to a Caucasian lady mm -hmm. and she sold me products and it made my cheeks turn light skin yeah and I was told that it had peroxide in it later and it wasn't good for my skin type so I'm glad that you pick things that are sensitive and targeted towards our skin type absolutely absolutely yes. Um, so everybody, I just got my face thing, but the camera cut off, so now she's about to tone my exfoliator. Um, this exfoliator is very light in general, but I have softened it up a lot more. Mm -hmm. Just because this is the first time you've had a facial in a minute, and I don't want to just bone rush your skin with a lot of um, exfoliating, a lot of different treatments all at once. Mm -hmm. It's important to... Um, Bring the skin in slowly into new treatments. And also this exfoliator that I'm using. So it's a mechanical exfoliator, which and it's also a chemical exfoliator. So it's a chemical exfoliator because of the rice enzymes that's in there. So I could just apply this onto your skin and let it sit for five minutes and it'll naturally exfoliate your skin without me or you having to do anything and just wipe it off at the end mm -hmm. but you could also get a deeper exfoliation which i'm going to work mainly on your forehead and your chin which is the areas that you need it the most okay. and the mechanical aspect of it is like the gritty part that you're probably feeling and that's just the rice um brand part I'm applying a lot more to your chin and your 
forehead. And that's the part that we're gonna work in for the next few minutes. It's not a game, it's a red stick. 